Harvey, welcome to Hamilton Island, mate, and uh, Thank you Bahrain much. Endurance is happy to have you here in, of course, Super League time. It's yeah. come around. Yeah, it's great to be here after, you know, hearing so many things about this race, and uh, I think it's going to be a really exciting and new format, and racing against the best triathletes in the world, so it's just amazing. A little concern, maybe, for you with the fact that you've just come off the, the break, and uh, now you're going to have to really mm. stress this part yeah. of your body, I feel, in this race. Yeah, definitely. But I've, I've been racing, uh, I've done a couple of races this year and they went very well. So I think I'm fit, I'm in good shape. And even though I don't know how I'm going to respond in this type of course and format, but I think no one knows. So it's new for everyone pretty much and that makes it more uh, interesting, more exciting. Do you think your experience is going to help you a little bit with this style of event? Hopefully, hopefully. I mean, I've uh, done many races in the past, but not many like that or similar. So, um, yeah, I'll try to still take calm and you have to be very focused, you know, in other races you know exactly what you have to do because every time it's kind of the same, but here you have to think a lot and the strategy is important as well, so you have to be very focused. Out of the three days, is there any pinch points, a point where you think, gosh, I've really got to be there at that time for that possible scenario to take place? Um, I guess probably the first day when you do, like, the different order of triathlon, you know, starting by with the run or starting with the bike. That's something that is kind of weird for us and uh, you have to be very careful, especially on the bike, when you start with the bike with everyone kind of fresh and to be in the right position, avoid crashes and, and problems. <laughs> Any sneaky Spanish tricks come race day that you might be able to lean back on and use? <laughs> no, I don't know, I don't know. It's just It's going to be a tough race. It's about about going hard all the time, really. There's not not many tricks. <laughs> okay, have you watched the old uh, stuff from this in the time gone by? Have you seen a few videos and seen yeah. what happened in those races? Yeah, I've seen a few videos and it's it's really entertaining, actually. It's really fun to watch, but I just can't imagine how tough it was for the guys to race. Oh, so. yeah, back then, yeah. So uh, I think it's going to be the same for us, but I think it was, it was something good for the sport and, and it's good to have it back. And this one, day one, there's 10 minute gap between each race. Hmm. Have you got any preconceived ideas of what you'll try and do or how yeah. you'll handle that 10 minutes? Are you yeah. just going to keep moving, stretch, I hydrate? I was trying to think of what to do, but with this extreme conditions, probably drink and get hydration, um, a little bit of stretch and, you know, you want to rest, but you don't want to rest too much. You want to keep active your body for to start the next one. But um, uh, yeah, uh, probably with this kind of heat, some, some ice would be nice. <laughs> and of course, the big news is this is going live into Bahrain. So yeah. His Highness will be watching. Yeah. Uh, he'll most probably be sitting in the Majlis with quite a few other people watching. Yeah. This. And there's a little bit of talk that His Majesty is yeah. also going to be watching. So uh, wow, you've got the, the pressure. The, the pressure's on. And <laughs> uh, yeah, His Highness has been doing like an amazing job for the sport and supporting the sport in many different levels. So I'm proud to be part of the team Bahrain and, and I hope to make him proud as well with a good result here. Yeah. Well, he's very proud to have you on board, mate. All Thank the you. best. Thank you very much. And uh, we'll be out there cheering Thank for you. you. Thank okay. you. Thank you. Have you, Gomez?